Play video. Firefighters were sent to Collingwood Road, Sutton, on Thursday evening in response to reports of a fire. Four children, all believed to be related, have died following a fire at a house in Sutton, South London. The force said it was called to the home in Collingwood Road shortly after 7 p.m. on Thursday. Firefighters in breathing apparatus entered the mid-terrace house in Collingwood Road as it was being ravaged by an intense blaze, before removing each of the four children and giving them CPR. In a statement, police said the children were treated at the scene before being taken to two South London hospitals where they were later pronounced dead. Next of kin are aware and will be provided with specialist support. Roads were closed as emergency services worked at the scene. Credit, PA. In a statement, London Fire Commissioner Andy Rowe said, This is an incident that has left everyone numb with profound sadness. My thoughts are with the family and friends of the children, the whole local community, and all those who will be affected by this fire. Fire crews arrived quickly and located the children inside the property. They were brought out of the house and given immediate emergency care. The welfare of our staff involved in this incident is very important to us and all of them will be offered counselling as a priority. Met Police Superintendent Rob Shepard said an investigation is underway to determine the cause of the fire. He added, the thoughts of everyone at the South Area Command Unit are with the family and friends of these four young children, who have suffered such a devastating and tragic loss tonight. I know these sentiments will be shared by the local community, Sutton and London as a whole. We remain on scene with our emergency service colleagues, and will be working through the night and beyond. At this very early stage the cause of the fire is unknown and will be investigated. The London Fire Brigade said eight fire engines and around 60 firefighters were called to the scene at just before 7 p.m.